Good morning, Mia. Good morning, guys. So, we are out here at a gas station just down the road from Mount Rushmore. We were gonna stay out in the Badlands, but last night we had the park rangers come out and tell us we can't camp out there. So we decided to just keep on driving further in the direction we were already planning on going. If you haven't been following along, Mia and I just left on a road trip toward the Badlands in South Dakota. Now we're headed to Mount Rushmore, I believe, today. I'm about to run in to this gas station and get chai tea latte because I got one last night and it tasted so good. I gotta get another one. You ready to go outside? All right, I'll get my chai after. <laughs> You're ready to go, aren't you? Here we go. Wanna go outside? Ready? Going to the grass, girl. Bless you. All right, guys. I'm just gonna walk her around for a few and go get a drink real quick. And I forgot to charge my camera batteries and stuff last night, so we gotta chill here for a bit while those charge up, and then we can take off. Sound like a plan, Mia? Sound like a plan? See you guys here in just a few minutes. Be right back. Be right back. Two seconds. I'm sorry. Hi, how are you doing? Good, and yourself? Doing well, thank you. Good. 3.82, please. Alrighty. Good. Receipt for you? I should be okay. Thank you. Thank you. Hey, you. Hey. What's up, kid? What's up? Come in here. I gotta feed you, girl. You wanna eat it out here? You wanna eat it right there? All right. Cheers, guys. So delicious. Ready? Let's do this. Let's do this. Let's go. Yeah. What's up? What's up, girl? How you doing? It is almost noon now. It was about nine o'clock this morning when we got up. So just kind of a late start to the day. I went and got her a little bone for a treat that she is almost done with. And we were just hanging out. I drank my chai. Went in, got a small coffee. Mm, which is super good too. It's a French vanilla coffee. Hey, can you come over here? You just... <laughs> We are headed to Mount Rushmore, guys. Let's come over here for a second, all right? Let's come right over there. There you go. We're about 27 minutes away. But yeah, we're gonna head over here. And I don't 
know if we'll like go fully into the park, like pay to get in. We'll probably just go to like a a good spot where you can pull off and look up at the mountain. And then after that, we're gonna be heading a little further down the road to some hiking trails. Oh yeah. And while we were chilling there, I was looking up some camping spots on iOverlander. There's a few spots over that way that we can go check out. To be honest, I hadn't even really thought of going to Mount Rushmore when I was heading out this way. It wasn't at the top of my my mind. I had other like Glacier National Park and like Teton, the Badlands. So I just didn't even really realize we were gonna be going right next to it. So yeah, this is kind of a cool surprise for me and for you guys. But anyway, we're gonna get to driving and we will catch up with you guys when we get a little closer. So. All right guys, quick break to thank the sponsor of today's video, Blue Eddie. And yes, I am in a house. I'm actually house sitting for my brother and his wife while they move out of state, but that's a story for another time. So first off, we have the Blue Eddie AC-180T. This is their first detachable battery power bank. I already took one out and stuck it in my Blue Eddy multi-cooler over here which runs off of the same batteries. This thing is an 1800 watt, 1433 watt hour power bank. It has two batteries. You could take them out and run the multi-cooler off of them. And you can run this thing off of just one battery as well. It has an output of 1200 watts with one battery and 1800 watts with two batteries. It's got a DC output, two USB-Cs, two USB A's and four AC outputs. You could charge this thing from the wall, from solar, and also you could charge it from your car. So if you're without power, you can get back up and running, lickety split. Next, we have the multi-cooler. It has a 40 liter compartment. It's also got these baskets, which are removable. And you can also turn the temperature down and utilize it as a freezer as well. And then it also has an ice maker over here, which I haven't used yet, but that thing would be pretty awesome on these hot summer days. So I might have to use that here soon. This thing runs off of the batteries from the AC-180T. You can also plug it into a car or plug it into the wall and just run it that way. It can run up to 140 hours with two of these AC-180T batteries. And if you have a way to keep that charging, you just have a consistent fridge right there, which is super convenient. Next, we have the AC240, which is the world's first IP65 water and dust resistant power bank. And we did test that out. If I still have the footage of that, I'll pop it up. That was super fun, getting to test it with my little brother Ian and uh, my sister Chloe and Lydia. But yeah, you can connect two of these power banks to each other for a total of 3,072 watt hours and 4,800 watts. And they also have expansion batteries, which you can connect the B210, and you can connect up to four of those, which will run at 10,136 watt hours. It's fast charging. It charges 80% in 45 minutes. You can control it from the app with Bluetooth or Wi-Fi. So if you guys are looking for a power bank like this AC240, the AC180T, or you need a way to keep stuff cool on the road, definitely check them out. I've been using them for a while now, and I mean, they're beasts. I'm very grateful to Blue Eddy for sponsoring today's video and just for believing in this journey I'm on, sending me these products when I really needed them. <laughs> Couldn't be more grateful. Click the link in the description if you want to check them out. Now, back to the video.
guys. Hopefully this leads us right to a uh, spot where we can pull off and view Mount Rushmore. But we will see. Mount Rushmore is one mile ahead. Wow! This is, oh there it is, right there in front of us. <laughs> that is sick. I don't know how well you guys saw that, but that was so cool. I wasn't even looking. Oh, well, I mean, I was looking for it, but I didn't think it'd be right in front of us. All right. Well, we made it. It's right there in front of us. Dang. This is so cool, guys. Seeing Mount Rushmore for the first time. Crazy. Honestly, I highly doubt going down here. Oh, the profile view. So, like, from the side. I wish I wasn't going down this hill right now, though, because... I don't want to go back up it. Oh wow, there it is. <laughs> That's super cool. You gonna go for a walk? Your tail's wagging. I think you're ready. There we go. Alright girl. That's crazy, guys. That definitely would have taken a while. A lot of chiseling. Hi. Now these are some mountains. It's crazy how different these are just from the ones in the Badlands, too. These are legit, like, rock type of mountains. Those were all, like, dirt and loose rock. So super sketchy when you're climbing around on them. But these are, these are straight up mountains. Crazy. What do you think, girl? Lots of smells, right? Lots of smells. Hey, they're just taking pictures. Let's do it. guys got to love it there's Mount Rushmore right up there this is a hill Mia don't even really want to take you out right here I just want to look at the view let me get out stay there stay there bro I'm just gonna pet you like this and look at the view like this. That is insane, huh, guys? I'll try to crop it in so you can actually see it because that's a little far away, but it's all good. This is gorgeous just to be in this spot right here. Watch out, Mia. There's cars coming all over. All right, we're gonna head to these hiking trails. It's about that time. I think we can get out. There's cars coming though, so watch yourself. Ah. There we go. Come here. Wow, guys. That's beautiful. 
Hi. Hi, sweet. You want to say hi? Hi, sweet little thing. What's her name? Mia. Mia. Yeah. Oh, you got a beautiful moon. <laughs> yeah, no problem. Have a good day, guys. Thank you. It actually looks like this trail goes all the way over to those rocks. And then there's like a little bridge over there. So I think we're gonna go try to check it out. This has got to be the prettiest lake I've ever seen. With the mountains just going right up to it like that. It's insane. Alright Mia, I gotta stop and tie my shoe. Hold on. Come here. Ooh, that's nasty. That's dirty, Mia. Okay, you're trying to go a little too quick. <laughs> These are wet rocks. <laughs> Woo! You did it. Good job. Oh, wow. Whoa, Mia. There's a whole drop off. Whoa! <laughs> wow. This is so beautiful, guys. Just a little dam back here. <laughs> it's slippery, be careful. You got those grippy paws, you're good. Oh, what? No way. <laughs> This is crazy. Oh my gosh, look at those boulders. They shouldn't be able to fall, but that's kind of scary. <laughs> this is crazy. Where does that lead? It leads up to the lake, yeah. Lake trail, okay. Yep, no problem. We're just in a canyon down here, guys. I had no idea that trail would lead us to a spot like this. <laughs> Gorgeous. You having fun out here, baby? Yeah? Let's check this out up here and then we can go back. Get some water. These trails just uh, zigzag all over the place back here. So there's arrows, but there's so many different trails. It's hard to tell which one you came in on. This is crazy though, guys. <laughs> I love it. Let's head back. Get some water. I'm getting thirsty. So you probably are too. Hi. Hi. Does this go very far or just? Uh, we didn't go super far, but it does. Yeah, it's a, right quite a few trails, yeah. yeah right. It's pretty though. All right, Mia, let's get up here for a second, just for a few. There you go. Come on. Good girl. You want some water? No? Not thirsty? All right, guys. Well, I really just need to grab my backpack and stuff, but I think we're going to chill out for a few, and I'm going to look at this uh, state park book that she gave me up there just see what there is out here at this park and then here soon we'll probably start heading to the spot we're gonna camp but i might try to find a different spot that's closer to this area we'll see i gotta check out i overlander 
I don't have service. <laughs> Alright, well, we gotta figure out what we're gonna do. So, we will see you guys here in just a bit. You're taking a nap over there, baby. <laughs> so this lake is called Sylvan Lake. There's a couple trailheads, like right over here. Obviously, we found a couple too, but I was looking in here and Black Elk Peak Trail. You okay? It's 3.3 miles and it's a one-way trail, so I don't know if we'll hike the whole thing. But there's also a couple other trails over here too, so I'm going to grab some water and we're going to hit some trails. And I'm hoping I can get service when I'm out there on the trail, because I don't really know the way to our campsite tonight. We're gonna hike on this side and see if we can go over by those rocks real quick. Check that out. I think she wants the geese, guys. <laughs> Mia, come on, let's go. Let's go. There's gonna be more this way, probably. Hi. Hi, how are you guys? Thank you, same to you. Hi. Hi. Oh, thank you guys. Did you build that? I did, yeah. Nice job. Thank you. I don't know how you do it. my camper. He must have seen me. <laughs> Is this too steep for you? Oh my goodness. <laughs> you just hopped right up that. I got myself a mountain goat. <laughs> wow, this is gorgeous. <laughs> what? Wow, I am a fan. Mia, hey, can you come up this way? Is that too high for you? What if I do it first? Oh my gosh, Mia. I didn't even turn around, you're too quick. You're crazy. Have you been out here before? I have not, no. What about you guys? <laughs> first time, no, we're just we're camping out here. Oh, nice, just the campground here. Yeah, camp. Sweet. Enjoy the rest of your day, guys. Yeah. <laughs> Stay here, Mia. I'm gonna jump and then I'll get you. There you go. Good job, Mia. You're a good climber. <laughs> There's chipmunks everywhere, girl. Oh, wow. This trail just went into the rocks. <laughs> it's just too beautiful. There we go. <laughs> Whoa. Just leads us down to the water down there. Come here. Beautiful. <laughs> How you guys doing? Ooh. Oh, this is a lot of steps. It's a lot of steps. Ah. Oh yeah. This is insane, man. Ah. Thank you guys for watching, supporting my journeys, helping us be able to do this kind of stuff. So grateful. All right. Looks like we made it to the official trailhead. This is a four mile loop, two to four hours. I don't know if we'll do the whole thing, but we're gonna hike some of it and see what happens. It already looks beautiful.
right behind you, girl. Woo! Look at the stream, Mia. This handrail is literally like just looped and zigzagged all over the place. Makes sense because this terrain is crazy. Yeah, we're climbing down the mountain right here. Wow! Whoa! This is so cool! We got steps in the water! <laughs> what do you think, Mia? What do you think about all this? He's like, this is too much. <laughs> Whoa! Let's go. Dang, I had no clue this trail was gonna be like this. It seems to be a recurring theme. I have no clue because I've never been here. <laughs> Literally everywhere you go is just another insane looking canyon. So gorgeous. Ready? My shoes are wet now, so this is, this is getting dangerous. Good thing they have the rails. Oh my gosh. Man, if those rails weren't there, I would have just fallen two times. What? How you guys doing? Oops, excuse us. Good, thank you. You're okay. Excuse us. It's a beautiful hike. Yeah. It's slick, isn't it? <laughs> you need some help? Yeah. Here. There you go. Yeah, no problem. Enjoy your hike, man. Thank you. There you go. Oh, there you, <laughs> you stepped right where I was going to put my foot. Oh, man. Man, 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 man. Come here. I almost slipped, baby. I had to let go of your leash. Let me grab you. Whew. Dang, guys. <laughs> this is intense, but 100% the coolest trail I've ever hiked. Yeah! It's just the combination of, like, the trail, mountains, and the streams like this. It's like three of my favorite things all in one. Look at this, though. Look at that view, Mia. All right, girl, you ready? You're doing good, Mia. Hey, you having fun out here? <laughs> oh, yeah. What are you looking at, girl? I don't like that. Her ears are perking up, looking straight off into the woods. That's kind of scary. Oh, there's a squirrel over there. I'm gonna say that's why. You could see the mountain peaks up there through the trees, guys. There's a little bit of a clearing. Oh my gosh. That is insane. Well, I was thinking about going back that way, but I think we're just gonna keep hiking instead. I don't know what this side is gonna be like, but hopefully a little easier to get up. It's about four o'clock now, guys, so we're probably gonna finish up these hikes and then head back to the truck, and I am gonna make some tasty food. I'm not sure what yet, but I'm so hungry, so it'll be something good. <laughs> Enjoy your hike, guys. Thank you. Ready? Oh, yeah. They're bouldering right now. Good job. Oh, excuse us. Hi. Hi, how are you? <laughs> excuse me. Some tight paths through here. Oh, we made it. Look at this, Mia. Whoa. This would be like such a cool place to just 
pitch a tent and go camping. Just surrounded by a stream and mountains like this. There you go. Nope, not my stroll. There you go. Good girl. Good girl, Mia. Oh, that's so refreshing. All right, Mia. Onward we go. Come here. You gotta wait. All right. Such a beautiful spot, guys. I love it. Whoa, those are some steps, baby. <laughs> are you getting in the creek? What are you doing? You're just wading through the water? You're crazy, girl. Ugh. That is unreal. South Dakota, man. Who'd have thunk? <laughs> wow. We made it. Oh my goodness. Went in that way, came out this way, did this whole loop right here. That was fun, man. <laughs> you just gonna run out into the water? What? Are you? Yeah? Oh my goodness. <laughs> she thought she could walk on water. You want to jump in and get some water, get refreshed up. You're getting your wet body all over in the dirt. Yeah, okay, you can stay out here. That's fine. <laughs> Woo -wee. That was a hike and a half. What is going on, fam? So it is about 6.30 now. So I decided to just go ahead and make dinner here before we take off and then go find our spot to camp for the night after this. Too hungry to be searching for a campsite without knowing where we're going because I haven't been able to get service. So we'll have to just start driving and hopefully get service before we get too far. But anyway, Today, I am gonna be making Billy Cheese Steakadillas. <laughs> if you watched my video yesterday, I made Philly Cheese Steaks, and I had quite a bit left over. Just some onion, pepper, steak mix. So, this should be super quick meal to make, since I already have most of it made. It started sprinkling too, guys so beautiful out there. I wish we could just camp here, but it's okay though, because I think there's some spots like 20 minutes down the road maybe. So we'll be good. I'm gonna go ahead and throw some salt, pepper, garlic mix on this stuff. This is just some thinly shaved steak. Works really well for Philly cheese steaks. Or sorry, Philly cheese thick of these. Sweet. 
shoot. Woo, that wind is going crazy. Cheers, guys. Mmm. Oh, yes. Go ahead and mix that together. Just let that heat up a little more. And then we can toss it on the quesadillas, or on the tortillas with some cheese. There you go. Yeah. These are pretty small tortillas, but they should work pretty well. Just make some small quesadillas. Layer of cheese down, and a layer of meat. on top. There we go. Still gonna have leftovers with this, I think. I was trying to use up my leftovers, but that's okay. Hey. Oh my man. This is for me, not for you. Hey, it's okay. It's okay. Oh. Billy Cheese Steak Adia number two. Alright, let's see how this one's doing. Oh, yeah. Oh, uh, yeah. That one's ready, too. Alrighty. Hey, hey, quit it. That's my plate. I'm still using that. You little whooper snapper. Get off my counter. Get off my counter. <laughs> You're crazy. <laughs> that one is done. This one probably is too, to be honest. My hand's falling off. Oh yeah. There we go. Mm. Cheers, guys. Good stuff, man. Mmm. Mm-hmm. I love quesadillas. Chicken, beef, steak, whatever you want to give me, I'll eat it. Yes. 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 Alright guys, we are just going to walk around for a few and then head back to the truck and get out of here. So. Such a gorgeous lake.
every direction too. So amazing. Hey, you ready? Jump. Yeah. I don't think those geese want you to get them, Mia. Ready? Good girl. That was so amazing. This is probably my favorite spot we've stopped at so far. As soon as I saw this, it was like, no way. <laughs> That's perfect. But we are gonna get out of here. So we will catch up with you guys here in just a bit. So this spot that I finally got to pull up is only six minutes away from here. So that is amazing. You chewing on your bone down there? Is that thing good? <laughs> You're really munching. It's a peanut butter bone I got from the gas station, guys. I think she likes it. Is this the way we came up? I don't even know. I think it was, but it looks different going down. Width, eight feet, nine inches. Height, nine feet, eight inches for this tunnel. Okay, yeah, this is the way I came. Hood tunnel. This is a one-way tunnel right here. Oh, yeah. Literally, my camper, it gets pretty close. good down there did you find it you lost your bone I'm not really in a position to... what oh I was not expecting <laughs> I thought we were gonna like get to the bottom of the, the mountains or something but it's just a little uh access road over here Make sure no one's coming I was thinking about pulling down to one of these roads if I couldn't find a spot because I saw it when I was pulling in and there weren't any signs saying you can't come back here. Oh, it's literally right here. I'm curious where those roads go though. I mean, I'd be down to drive up that hill over there. See what's up there. I don't have much data here, which is fine. I don't have to watch YouTube or anything to go to sleep. It's nice, but Yeah, this is a pretty spot. This is so much better. You got a whole view of the mountains back here. Look at that. We were down in the valley down there. You all right? <laughs> That's amazing. Let me get out and check. Make sure we're good. You wanna come out too? All right, come on, come on. Yeah, yeah. So right now I'm in the Black Hills National Forest. In my last video, I believe it was, I had the park rangers kick me out of the Badlands or told me I couldn't camp there. And they said to come this way because there's a ton of free camping you can do out here. So pretty cool. And it's beautiful. <laughs> what do you think about this spot, huh? This is amazing. Sweet. Look at that, girl. We got ourselves a home out here in the middle of nowhere. What do you think? 
I love it. I'm actually gonna close that so no bugs fly in. Perfect spot to end off a good day, I'd say. Tonight, I think we're just gonna hang out and get cozy up in there. Nothing better than coming out in the middle of the woods and having your home with you. <laughs> it's so cool. Oh, there's a deer way over there. Mia, I saw a deer. She actually spotted one earlier when we were in the camper. She was looking out the door and I was like, what are you looking at? I thought she was looking at a person, but it was a deer. It's like, whoa. Whoa, man, that's crazy. <laughs> oh, there it is. There it is. Look at that thing. She saw it now. We're gonna go to the top of this mountain right here. Try to see if we can have a good view of the sunset. Okay, maybe not the top, but like right here. <sighs> oh man. I love it. Ready? Go get it! Yeah! You love your sticks, don't you? And I love my sunsets. <laughs> I love it. So fun watching her play and be all happy. You make life better. Ooh, I found a fresh stick pile. Just for Mia. Just for Mia. <laughs> you went right past it. <laughs> she had too much speed. <laughs> yeah. Up here, come on. There you go. Oh, no. There's a bug in here, Mia. It just zipped past my ear. It sounded like a big one. I hear it buzzing somewhere. That's kind of creepy when you're in the small quarters. All right, guys. Well, it is time for us to kick it. That was an amazing day, though. Seeing Mount Rushmore for the first time. Just checking out all these mountains and all this kind of scenery just seriously blows my mind. If you can't tell from <laughs> my reactions, I've wanted to come out west for a long time. So the fact that it's actually happening and we're out here like this is amazing. And I'm very grateful to you guys for tagging along with me and for watching these journeys. Definitely helps my travels. So, life is good, man. Subscribe to follow along with our journeys, and we will see you guys in the next one. Peace.